The biggest little rodeo in the Midwest is underway right now in New Windsor, Illinois, celebrating its 82nd year. Kelly Weber joins us live this afternoon from the fair and rodeo. Kelly, how are you? Thanks for being with us. I'm doing great. How are you guys doing today? Doing well. Oh, doing well. Talk to us about the rodeo. There's yeah. there's eight events, something for everyone. Talk about those. Yes. Yeah, so We'll go again tonight at 7, and actually we kick off about 6 o'clock. We have kids' night tonight. We'll have bouncy horses, sick horses, a buck and bull for the kids to ride on. And then we'll roll into the rodeo at 7 with our pre-events of our flags of corporate sponsors, our national anthem, skydiver, Bobby Reed. And then we'll get started. We start with buck and bulls right off the get-go, everybody's favorite event. We'll roll through into steer wrestling, calf roping, uh, cowgirls breakaway, cowgirls barrel racing, and then we go right back into bulls again with the NFPB bull bus. A skydiver. Wow. That's incredible. There's just a ton going on and I love like that you're talking to us from New Windsor this afternoon because while we love having our guests in studio I think like just the landscape behind Kelly this afternoon just like kind of makes you really want to be there you Absolutely. know what I mean you can see the track oh. the track behind you and everything like that and all the dirt uh, so uh, talk a little bit about you know this going on for 82 years you must really um, have people that are just massive fans of the New Windsor Rodeo. They come every year. What do you think makes it so special? It's a family tradition. Whether it is our spectators coming to watch or it's us board members. We have multiple generation board members. We get some that are new to the area and they came though as kids and they want to be board members. And then we always hear from our spectators about how much, oh, I came here with my mom and dad and now I'm bringing my kids so it's just a family tradition all the way through. Yeah, and this is like, a, you know, a really big highlight. Um, you guys are kind of on the map as far as rodeos go as well, Kelly. Yes, yeah, so with the IPRA, we're actually the longest standing IPRA sanctioned rodeo. So that in itself holds some roots. So once again, we're just roots around here. And we should mention, too, uh, there's also a fair going on uh, surrounding the rodeo. Uh, you listed a lot of different things that were, that were going on, but there's kind of like a carnival feel as well. Yeah, so I don't know, Russ, if you want to pan out or if you can get behind me here, you can see all the carnival rides are behind us. They start at 5 o'clock at CDAC, and they've been coming as the carnival since I was a young girl myself here riding rides. So... It's nice to have them back every year. And then uh, tomorrow will be our kitty parade. Uh, so the carnival will actually go on during the afternoon and the evening on Saturday after the kitty parade. So, yeah, you can enjoy that. You can walk through the hobby buildings. Uh, we have fruits, vegetables. We have uh, kids' hobbies that they do. We have uh, interesting crafts from adults. And we also have quilting that adults have made and brought in. We have plenty of vendors in the park that you can get little uh, anywhere from Tupperware to saddles to a new cowboy hat to wear. Well, there's plenty of fun to be had for sure. Kelly, thank you for joining us. Uh, here's uh, on what's on tap for the rodeo tonight. Um, we've got uh, the carnival that opens at 5, kids stick horse races at 6, and then the rodeo and mutton bustin' begins at 7. And then tomorrow, uh, some of the highlights that you can expect is the day starts off at the rodeo run at 8, the junior horse show begins at 9, there's a kitty parade at 1, as Kelly mentioned, and then the regular schedule for the rest of the evening. So we thank Kelly for being yeah, with us today. So yeah. much fun. It, very, a, a lot of fun and fun seeing her out there too. Just kind of a little bit of a change of scenery Absolutely. for us this afternoon. I love that. Yeehaw.